Oh, what? This idea of God. All are the same equal thickness. Well being Nigeria Limited, the stainless people. This machine was designed to be used in the presence of granola paste. That's what we must do it with. And what this machine does is that it cuts the paste to size. It flatten it out, it cuts it to, cuts it to size, and then make impressions on it, different kind of shapes on the paste before going into the deep fryer. Now this is the way the machine is used. These are the kits here, the complete kit. This is the way the machine is used. You place this part from here. Place it there that way. And then you apply a thin film of granite oil on this. A thin film of granite oil to avoid this paste from getting stuck to the metal material. And then you take a chunk of the granite paste, put it here, and then with the aid of this roller. With the aid of this roller, you flatten it out. You flatten it out to whatever thickness you desire. And then, before you do that, this roller must you must apply a thin film of oil on it too, so that the paste does not get stuck to it. You flatten it out to your desired thickness. You work it carefully, 
and after that the head of your cutter this is a cutter these are sharp stainless edges there are four of them in this case you can have it up to eight up to ten and then how this works is this after flattening flattening it out okay i think after flattening it out you press this down hard on the paste and then these marks these um, marks are impressed on the granite paste for this particular customer this is the shape that he liked he desired so when you press this and lift it up you have these vertical marks on the paste then after doing that you break this down this is the cutter you break it down you press it hard once on it and then turn it around press it hard once apply a vertical downward pressure on it and then because you have done it twice this way and this way find that i have the crosses this way and then this way on the granite paste so it will have cut it that way then the next thing you do is with the aid of your spatula you bring out this platform that you remember that paste is here you do this out then you scoop out the off course you scoop out the off course you scrape it out and then you can move the flattened paste with shapes you can move them into hot oil and deep fry so now this guy this pla uh, platform here you can have a, a, a number of them like two three or four depending on you because uh, once you put it here and you have flattened out on it you can take it out after cutting to shape you can take it out drop it on your work table and then put another one so while somebody is dealing with the rest of this while somebody is working on the rest of this another person is is doing this so you can have two or more of this on one machine and then this cutter you notice in this case that there are only four rows if you impress it this way and then impress it this way you have 16 pieces at a time you can have this up to you can scale it up up to six eight or even ten so that if you have it up to ten if you impress it this way and then impress it this way it means you are going to have 20 10 by 10 which is 100 flat chips um coolie uh, coolie uh, at a time so you can scale this up to give you up to 100 at a time i can also increase the number of these to speed, to speed up production so that after pressing you can take it out to the head of the spatula and then put another one why somebody deals with this and this spatula is very good at scraping out the paste very effective thank you